Marquette junior Tori McCoy couldn't spend the offseason working on her jump shot. She couldn't spend it working on her post moves. Instead, she spent three and a half hours, three days a week, on kidney dialysis. It's a struggle. <laughs> it's, it's really bad. A year ago, she was getting sick during practice, and neither she nor her trainers could figure out why. Here we go, Amanda. Did a blood test, and they were like, oh, your kidneys are dead. And I was just like, whoa. Tori has FSGS, a rare kidney disease, and she has no family history. The only cure is a new kidney. Right now, she's on the national donor wait list, which could take years. Until she gets a new kidney, there's not much she can do on the court. Heartbreaking. You know, here's a kid who's McDonald's All-American at the top of her game, one of the best players in the country. This whole ordeal has understandably been tough on Tori. She can't play anymore. However, she has found a new role on her team. Down here, you got to pick it up. Keegs actually thought it was a great idea for me to be one of the coaches. She puts a whistle on her neck right now. She jumps and drills. She's a dummy defender. She started to work out again in our, in our weight room. So I, I just see a smile on her face when she comes in and has basketball a part of her life. There we go. I didn't want any of this information to get out because I didn't like people just asking me questions. But um, I think it's important. Important because she wants other people to know that they aren't alone. but. Also because her best chance at a transplant is to find a live donor to give her one of their kidneys.